it happened. You quit cigarettes, you started vaping, and uh, now you're Einstein. You know everything, and you need to tell the world what you think about every single e-liquid and device that you try. You think that you're a reviewer. Welcome to the first stage of vaping hysteria. You start a YouTube channel, right? You got vaping on the mind. It's all you can think about. 24-7, how charged are my batteries? You think you got what it takes. You're going to start making videos. You can share your knowledge with the world. If this is you, then you need some serious tips so that you don't suck. Okay? So let's look at some helpful tips for soon-to-be vaping reviewers. But first, let's talk about, you know, the top reviewers. There's a reason why you connect with them. You feel like you're sitting across a table with them and you're talking about vaping. And that's just because their camera is at eye level, alright? And it's a smart move. Hi, welcome to Squonky Vapes. Today I'm going to show you how to clean your squonkers, okay? This. What is this? This, alright. All right. Let me rephrase the opening. Hi, welcome to Danny's Ceiling. Today we'll be reviewing some of the nicest, newest ceilings, uh, you know, on the market. Unless you review ceilings, we should not be seeing more ceiling than wall behind you, okay? Because it makes us feel uneasy, and it makes you look lazy. So put your laptop on a box, okay? And while I have you in this dentist chair, maybe I could remove your teeth, okay? Now say ah. All right, so are you feeling me here? Hi, welcome to the show. I'm the vaping astronaut. T today I'll be showing you how to spill e-liquid on your desk. All right, this is the opposite problem, okay? Please, sit down, won't you? We can talk about vaping. No? You just want to stand there looming over me? Okay, I'm fine with that. If your camera is up too high, it's because you put it too high. Keep it like a person would see you, right? Not this. Not this. This. Hi, I'm the vape, vapey vapor. Vaping away here at the vape cave. Uh, today I'm gonna be reviewing this battery. Um, I don't know if you can see, uh, let me, it's, let me, can I, uh, we get it. You don't have a camera guy. You are in a TV studio. Nothing's more frustrating than watching you and your misunderstanding of your camera. Some cameras can't focus close. So it depends on the camera and how much of a jackass you are. So figure the shit out. I'm TJ Clouds. And we are about to get vaping. What's up? Welcome to Vapor Snatch. I'm the I'm the Duke of Drip, and you're not. All right, guys. And until next time, vape them like you stole them. All right, that's all I got. So until next time, don't smoke cigarettes a lot. Catchphrases. Apparently, to make a vaping video. You know, you need a repeatable phrase because people are robots and without a repeating signal, they'll start walking into walls. Now, I'm not going to spout off all the other reviewers' catchphrases because you already know them. All that matters is what's yours going to be. Hmm? Maybe you're above all that. Maybe you can just talk like a normal person. Maybe that's your thing. But as a vape reviewer, that's a choice you're going to have to make, and you're going to have to make it quick. All right, vape hard. Hi, I'm Pookie Vape Nuts. Now, let's go down close and take a look at this new RDA, the Areola V2.
Hey, what happened? It's supposed to cut to my RDA. What? Why isn't it, Why isn't it working? It's not working because people used it too much and broke it. It's broken now. You can't blow vapor at the lens and then cut as a vapor transition. So what are you going to do? I don't know, Xerox, maybe you ought to think of something new and just not copy everything you see. One thing's for sure, we don't need to see it again. Now, if you're going to be doing these reviews, there's one big thing that's going to be in your way constantly. That's pronunciations. The vaping industry has the worst named products of any industry in the world. Uh, they seemingly choose the most e easily forgotten, hard to say, spell, read names for their devices. Almost as if they want you to forget them or not be able to pronounce them. Now, the list of companies and devices uh, is too long for me to even name them all. You're going to find yourself having to deal with a lot of really stupid uh, words and difficult pronunciations. So get ready for that. A simple example, the K-Fun. No, it's, it's actually, it's k -fun, actually. Here's an example where no one could say it right, so we refuse to. Actually, it's called the Kefun. No, it's called the Kefun. I think it's actually pronounced Kefun. We want to have fun. We don't want to have foon, okay? And then my friends over in uh, the UK, there's a smoke tech or smoke. It's not smock tech. I know, I know. There's no E. How dare we? How dare we say it smoke? There's no E. We have to say it smock. Smock's an ugly dress. Is vaping about technology replacing smoking or technology replacing ugly dresses? It's smoke tech. Hi folks, Vaping Superhawk here with another vape review. But before I review this drip tip, I need to clear the air about some things that were said about me in the bathrooms at Vape Questicon. Now, you guys know that I would never blah 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 blah. <sighs> Drama. Maybe you've heard of it if you're a fan of junior high school or soap operas. Now this is an area where smokers are more evolved than vapors because within the vape community the drama never seems to end. You know, now given we are under a lot of stress, you know, every country is trying to ream us with lies and political agendas. But enjoying vaping has nothing to do with listening to this crap. It's only drama if people make it dramatic. So don't Give it any energy, don't start it, don't react to it. If you you know, if you don't fan the flames, you you usually find that it's boils down to two people being babies. Don't take sides, don't do anything. Just let them cry themselves to sleep. And lastly, probably the most important tip I can give any new reviewer. And you're going to want to get a pen and paper and write this down. Or if you're on your computer, you know, open something up so you can type this out. Because you're going to need this phrase, okay? So you'll need to memorize this line. If you want to learn more about this device, check out P. Busardo's review. The link's below. Good luck with your reviews. And vape hard.